Hi everybody, welcome back to Mosaic Monday. Uh, this is going to be our last Mosaic Monday for the year, and this craft is going to be paper mache maracas. To start, you're going to need a balloon, some thin paper, we're using paper towel, you could use newspaper, tissue paper, whatever you want. Then you're going to want some flour and some water, something to stir it in, and a spoon to stir with. For your paper mache mixture, you're going to want to use about one part flour to two parts water. Depending on how sticky you want it to be, you're going to want to add more flour or more water. If you want it to be more sticky, you're going to add extra flour, and if you want it to be less sticky, you're going to add more water. stir that until you get the consistency you want and you want to make sure there's no clumps. This is about the size I'm going to make. Then you're going to want to take your paper and dip it in your paper mache and stick it on. So when you're done your first layer, it should look something like this. The more layers you do, the harder your maraca gets, so you're going to want to do more so that it doesn't break. I'm going to do about two to three more layers on this one and then leave it to dry for about 12 hours. And while you're waiting for your balloon to dry, you can fold your handle for the maraca. So what you'll do is you'll take kind of a thicker piece of paper, fold it in half, like that, and then fold each of the halves in half as well, like this. And so now that we've done that, we can go through and you can find each of these panels that we folded, like that, and you'll cut a slit at the top of each of them. And then we'll uh, fold them together into a triangle like this. See how it's kind of like a handle now? Uh, two of the sides will overlap like that, so that's how we get that shape. And then we can glue them together. And then once your sides are overlapping, you can also cut a slit on each of the corners of the triangle. There's your handle. After you've let your paste dry, you're going to want to pop the balloon with something. After you've popped your balloon, you're going to want to take a pair of scissors and cut off the balloon now. We're just going to repeat the same process we did with the paste and the paper towel. So you're just going to dip it in the glue and stick it on here. Make sure you don't get any of the grain on the glue because it's going to stick to it. After you've let the opening dry, you're going to want to paint it. Alright, so we're going to hot glue our handle to our maraca. Uh, we're using hot glue, but you can also use regular white glue or the paper mache that we were using earlier to uh, cover the balloon. And so what you're going to do is you're just going to apply the glue to each of the flaps that we cut out. Like so. And 
then just stick it on to wherever it's going to fit on the glue. Uh, you might want a parent to help you with this part because hot glue is hot uh, and it can burn you if you're not careful. And after your glue is dried, uh, you can go ahead and decorate your maracas handle as well as the maraca itself.